Hey UBC Thunderbird fans, Dan Elliott here, back for another edition of Thunderbirds this week. I'm standing at the Doug Mitchell Thunderbird Sports Center. Right behind me, it is the men's hockey team that's in the middle of practice. They're gearing up for a road trip to Calgary to take on Mount Royal. Now, while they're away, the women's team is going to be in action here on Friday night and Saturday afternoon. They are taking on the Mount Royal Cougars from Calgary. They're a new team, the CIS, this year. And the UBC Thunderbirds women's team, while well, they are red hot right now. They're coming off a huge weekend sweep over the Saskatchewan Huskies and currently have a record of four wins, two losses and two overtime losses. So games this weekend, Friday night at seven and then a matinee affair on Saturday afternoon, two o'clock right here at the Doug. A big change has come to the women's program. What's kind of been the maybe the defining factor for you guys this year? Well, I think uh, Graham's obviously done a lot of work. Um, so that's one of the big reasons why we're having a lot of success. But we have the tools ourselves as players this year that we never had before. We have amazing depth that um, I haven't seen in quite a few years here. So um, I think we have a really good chance this year to do something big. We're really uh, proud of the girls right now. We're really excited with how everything's going. Um, obviously, we don't want to get too too overconfident. Um, we need to enjoy this and enjoy um, what we've you know earned and how how we're working hard and how we're having some success early. Anybody in the Can West League and CIS League um, is a good team. Anyone can beat anybody um, any weekend. And Mount Royal, you know, we're expecting big things from them. They have some good players, um, some players that we're familiar with as well. So, um, you know, we're, we're not going to take anybody lightly. We're just going to. We go as hard as we can this weekend. Over at War Memorial Gym this weekend, you can check out all the volleyball action going on. A couple of the top teams in Canada doing battle on the women's side. It's going to be the number two ranked UBC Thunderbirds coming off that split last weekend versus Trinity Western. They're going to take on the number three team in the country. That is the Alberta Pandas. They play Friday and Saturday night. Friday at 6 o'clock and Saturday at 5 o'clock. Following the women's game, the men will be in action as they take on the number one ranked team in the nation, the Alberta Golden Bears. Golden Bears on the male side, Pandas on the female side. Tough to get a handle on, but I think we are figuring out. It should be a great match. Matchup. UBC, of course, coming off that split with Trinity Western last weekend, looking to step it up against the number one team in the nation. Those games go at 8 o'clock on Friday night and 7 o'clock Saturday night, both at War Memorial Gym. That does it for everything that's going on at home this weekend, but tons of playoff action also taking part this weekend uh, across the country. In fact, uh, beginning right here in British Columbia as the women's soccer team will be at Trinity Western for the Canada West Final Four. They play Friday night against Victoria. If they win that, they will move on to the final the following day. As for the men's soccer team, undefeated this year, number one in the Canada West. They are in Alberta for the Canada West playoffs. They get a bye to the semifinal, and they will play the winner of Saskatchewan and Victoria in the quarterfinal. So that will be a big matchup in the semi. They win that. Of course, they will move on to the gold medal match the following day. And as well, the UBC women's field hockey team, the number one ranked team in the nation. They are at the Nationals. Of course, they're coming off their 10th straight Canada West title and looking for a national championship. Once again, you can follow all the action at our website at GoThunderbirds.ca. You can follow us on Twitter at UBCTBirds, hashtag GoBirdsGo. Enjoy all the action this weekend. We'll see you at the game.